guys, welcome back. Anglers Fall here, and we're back with some more Project Hospital. Oh, I want to thank you guys for all the support you're showing for this series. It is really awesome to see you all guys, all of you guys coming in and watching, subscribing, liking, commenting. Oh, I'm loving it. Thank you so much. Honestly, you guys are making this series even more enjoyable than I thought it would be when I first started. I just wanted to play it because I really wanted to play it. Now, the fact that you guys are all involved, oh, it's awesome. So, yeah, I just wanted to say thank you to all of you. It is, yeah, it is great. Um, So, yeah, what did we do last time? We, um, we, what did we do? What did we do? Oh, yeah, we moved the labs, didn't we? We moved the labs to their, to their home at the back of the hospital. The most annoying place ever for a lab to be, but that's where it is. Um, And we put in our first CT room. Is that a CT room, right? That is a CT room. CT room, yes, we put in a CT room. So yes, we have one of those. That is a thing now. Um, yes, uh, we we're not moving on. We're not moving too bad. We did. Oh Christ! Wrong button. Wrong button. That's the button I wanted. Um, we did lose a fair bit of money just because we did a lot of building. So so yeah, minus twenty six uh, six thousand. So yeah, that was painful. The day before minus twenty thousand. But yeah, it was. We've had two days where we've done a lot of building. Technically, we're made it making 14,000. Yeah, so that's not so bad, really. I'm thinking 14,000 is a decent bit of profit. So, um, yeah, what we could do, we could... um, we Oh, look at internal medicines. Oh, look at that hospitalisation. Look at the amount of hospitalisation makes us. That is fantastic. We need some more hospitalisation around the place. But yeah, we're, we're making some decent money. So I'm liking that, um, but yeah, we need to expand. We we definitely need to expand. We need a hospital. We need emergency room, and we need intensive care. That's for sure. Um, but at this point in time, I don't think we've got enough money to do that. So what we are going to do, we are just going to carry on. We're going to work through Oopsie Diet. Oopsie, what is it? Oopsie Corp. Oopsie Corporation, and get these 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 things done. And that should hopefully make Dr. Foll down here, uh, our actual player-controlled doctor. Where is she? There she be. Our player-controlled doctor. We shall make her better. She's a 20-year-old doctor. She is currently a resident. She started at zero and zero. She currently has 39% and 8%. That's not bad at all. She is learning on the job because she's got practical diagnosis, 20% bonus experience to diagnosis skill after successful diagnosis. So that's quite cool. Um, so, so yeah, we are we are improving her her skills. So we're going to spend a couple of days just making some money, um, and just making sure that the hospital runs well. We might need another pharmacist. This this is where we might have to go. Another pharmacist might be ideal. We're currently doing an oral exam on this woman, even though we have no idea what is wrong with her but i did have a quick look look that's an internal medicine so you know what we're going to move you to internal medicine please go get out of my sight <laughs> i don't want anything to do with you because i'm not going to manage to diagnose you so yeah so yeah i think that's where we're going i think yeah i think this may be do we i think yeah let's sort out pharmacy just quickly quickly sort out the old pharmacy area All right what we're gonna do we're gonna do in here we're gonna no that's not what i wanted to do i wanted to bulldoze remove objects yeah there you go remove that what we'll do uh we'll do a what is this this is a an advice we'll do a drop off one why not and then like i say we'll expand it further that way in the future once we get rid of the cleaning closet and once we make it bigger so that's fine so i know it's not it's not an edge one it, it it doesn't look how it should look but you know what it is fine we will do that so we can get an extra pharmacist in here here we go pharmacist in the day what are we going to go for oh we've got david king three hidden perks what are you you have fast metabolism resistance oh you know what let's re-roll uh 1674 what are you hard worker doesn't take any very clean shoes you know what judy martinez you're coming in and we'll have a look see if we need a nighttime one but yeah this should help us clear out i think we probably do need a, a nighttime person why why are you not sitting on your chair get to your chair mm. okay okay where are we 
Angles is going for some food, obviously. Of course she's going for food. She always goes for food. It's fine. It's fine. Right. We 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 spent some money there, but it's all good. It's all good. We're making money back. Uh, both pharmacists are on break. Actually, what I did want to do in pharmacy, let's change their clothes. Where are we? Technologists. Let's make you green. There we go. That I, I like that a little bit better. Oh, employee leveled up special. Who are you, Barbara Martin? Okay, fellow. Okay, you can get. Okay, so once you get to four, you become a fellow and you can have advanced. Okay, so what do we want you to have, maybe? Uh, advanced diagnosis or... Yeah, you know what? Advanced diagnosis is not a bad thing. Yes. So actually, on Dr. Fall, can we... Ah, okay, yeah, so that's her... Sp yeah, general medicine. Okay, that's fine. General medicine, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Trisha Martin, she's the one... Oh, she's the one I was faffing around with, isn't it? Okay. Okay, well, we can't do anything with you, can we? We'll get you alive. And you know what? Send away. Yeah. There we go. Someone go get her, because we can't do anything. We haven't got an ITU department. We're just keeping her alive. There we go. Send her somewhere else. She will not die on our watch. She will not die on our watch. It's fine. It's all good. Um, yeah, I spent far too long with her, didn't I? That wasn't good. Um, but yeah, we haven't really got many patients coming in, or none coming to see us in any case. We're pretty up to date in here. Oh, here we go, here we go. Uh, he's not eating, he's got arm pain. What is it? So, itchy, oh, itchy blisters, loss of appetite. Well, you got chicken pox, there you go. Have all of the above. Okay. Here we go, we've got number 17. Awesomeness, awesomeness. William Moore, teacher. I do wonder, let me know down below if teacher has anything, if their occupation has anything to do with like their um their their stuff, their symptoms. Because obviously, yeah, teacher getting if you're around kids. Depends obviously how old the kids are, but yeah, they're gonna have loads of chicken pox, so that could um that could then do it, couldn't it? Yeah, um, yeah, I'll have to keep an eye out for that. I'm curious. I'm curious. Although, I'm wondering, should we now control an extra doctor, possibly? Because then we'd see a few more patients, wouldn't we? That could be really helpful. If we saw more patients, that would get this done a lot quicker. Might have to, you know, might have to. Uh, golfer's elbow or elbow bursitis. You know what, let's just do a physical examination to start with. Because we shouldn't have to send you for an x-ray for that. It will probably want us to go for an x-ray. I've had elbow bursitis. Oh man. That was not fun. Elbow bursitis. The, the, on my elbow, I literally just had a... It was about the size... Nearly, well, I was going to say tennis ball. No, somewhere between like a golf ball and a tennis ball. The, on the end of my elbow. Oh my good God. Couldn't do anything. And I'd literally just started three weeks of annual leave. I wanted to redo my whole garden. Go to the doctor. They're like, no, do not use your arm for five to six weeks. I dug over my whole garden. Left-handed. One hand. Eh, it was it was not good it was not a good thing but i got it done i got it done um but yeah no bursitis is not a fun one and yeah it really does it impinges your nerves and stuff so yeah golfer's elbow it's not going to be too different but yeah should have just poked and prodded at his elbow realized that there's no fluid or whatever i don't know i don't know i'm no doctor but yeah it, no, it was not fun but yeah as you can see i've given all of these I gave all of those treatments and look they're all suppressed now so that's quite cool suppressed 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 perfect right go home there we go i'll go to pharmacy and then go home yeah pharmacy is looking good ah yeah they've changed their outfits that's good that is much nicer i'm wondering do we change the x-ray because purple purple in x-ray i mean seriously seriously do we want purple in x-ray do we go gray yeah, I think grey. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because then what have we got in the labs? We've got black, haven't we? The labs are black, yeah. Although, I'm not liking the fact that the patients are coming into the lab. No, 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 no. Why Why is that a thing? Why is that a thing that's happening? Why do we have blood traipsed around here? How is this place looking? Not looking too bad. Uh, Yeah, we're not looking too bad. Two and two. That's good. That's good. Oh... Uh, cyclothorax. What do you need? HDU. Oh, actually, we can deal with you. Okay, okay, okay. Give him a load of that. Give him a bit of everything. 
Photosynthesis. Here, isn't it? Oscars, what are you having? Meep. Minimally invasive endoscopic procedure. But yeah, she just needed to go to HTU. Where is she? Oh, uh, no. See? Yeah. ITU. I thought so. Mm. Send away. Where are you? Oh, you are actually in HTU. Okay. That you... Oh, no, that's Judy Martinez. Is that you there? Yeah. Collapsing. So she's a cook. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just have a quick look. So she's a cook. Chest pain plur Okay, well, no. That's that's not related at all. That is not related at all. Like I say, my, my theory of does it matter if they've got um certain jobs? Does it mean they get certain things? I don't know whether that is the case. I don't know. I'm thinking I do need to control a few more doctors here, don't I? Because we are running thin on patients. And again... We're not going to be making much money because we've got lower insurance payments. Okay, you're a haemophiliac, so you need some... You need some desmopressin or something, don't you? Uh, what is that? Internal medicine. Oh, so I need to transfer you to internal medicine. Okay, there we go. There you go. Go to internal medicine, then you can be hospitalised. There you go. With some desmopressin. What does that do? Um, anti-diuretic, synthetic hormones, stimulate factors responsible. Okay. Okay, I'd have just given them some will eight or something like that. Some factor eight concentrate. If they're haemophiliac and bleeding, give them some factor eight. That kind of makes sense, right? But who am I? Who am I to ask? Who am I to ask? Again, coagulation was never my thing in hematology. <laughs> nope. Nope. Not my thing at all. I preferred the old full blood counts, looking down the microscope at the cells and stuff like that. Much more enjoyable. Um, but yeah, we're not doing too bad. We're not doing too bad. We're 19. You've got iron deficiency anemia. You need some iron. You really... Yeah, you... Yeah, you just need iron supplementation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do not need to be in. You don't, do you? No. No, if you're iron deficiency anemia, although you have chest pain. Uh, we'll see how this goes. If we can manage to get rid of that, the bronchodilators might sort out the chest pain. Got a crumbly nail as well. Really? Oh, I suppose that is a thing of, um... That is a thing of, um, iron deficiency, isn't it? Because you haven't got iron to then do all the stuff. Yeah, 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 that makes sense. Okay, yeah, we've got all this sorted. Right, okay. Rooms with critical workloads. Who... Who's got critical? Um, okay, so that's radiology. No... Oh, critical. What's that? Medical laboratories. Which one? Good boss, hungry. Yeah, fine. Um, labs. Medium critical in hematology. Okay. Okay, that's a good one to know. Okay, and then here. I'm guessing no. So who, who's the second one critical? Ah, here we go. Labs and internal medicine. Okay, internal medicine... Critical. Medium. Okay, so that should spread out. That's fine. That's fine. Totally, totally fine. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're fine. We're totally fine. Right, come on. Let me send him home. Send home. There you go. Go home. Oh, we've got no pharmacist, have we? Oh, good God, look at how dirty this is. We definitely need more cleaners, don't we? Definitely need more cleaners. Where's the dude I just sent home? Are you going to pharmacy? You're now just going to wait for hours and hours. Do we have... Are these nighttime janitors? No. Okay, 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 okay. Admin. Here. There we go. Let's go for a nighttime janitor. Ooh. Rest, distance, efficiency, dexterity. You seem pretty good. Mary Lopez is fine. I don't need to know your hidden trait. It's fine. There we go. There you go, you can get cleaning now. Good. Get to the cleaning, because it's dirty around here. It's very, very dirty. Yes, perfect. Excellent. Right, that's another day done. Do we... You know what? Let's goink. i take control. Uh, no, that's not what I want to do. Who have we got here? So, add... Select a doctor. Uh, how do I... Uh -huh. Dismiss. No. Select department, which, so add employee, no, I want to just add a controlled doctor. Because I 
advanced diagnosis are going to be good. Do I connect the doctor and all their... I just want to add some doctors, please. Please let me add doctors. You there, how do I control you? How do I control you? If I star you, can I control you? No, let's star you. Well, no, we'll star you because I do want to control you at some point. You're a fellow. You are a fellow. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Select a doctor. So, yeah, you. If I... No, how do I do this? Rename. Bin card. Ah. Ah, there we go. Nah, there we go. Got it. Right, David Robinson. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so that adds us some more people. Yeah, we'll get a few more. We'll get a few more diagnosed, right? You know what? Pause, pause, pause for the briefest of seconds. You know what? Let's get Frank Hall as well. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we'll whiz, th we'll whiz through this now. Okay, go to. Uh, I think you've got chronic fatigue syndrome. I think maybe. Night sweats, sore throat, sleeping problems. Did you do a speech listening? But no, we'll go for that. Joink, 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 joink. Have all of the above. There we go. Oh, perfect. Look, look this is how we want it. All oh, right. Okay. Weakness, breathing problems. Right. Let's do a physical examination on you. Frank Hall, who is fantastic. So, yeah. Yeah. And he's looking after Fraser Hill. <laughs> Nothing like confusion. Um, okay. So, we found headache. Pne pneumonic plague struck by lightning. Good grief. Good, uh, okay. Breathing problem, weakness. You know what? Let's do a listen to your chest and a neck palpation. Because why not? You there. Are you ready to go home yet? Nearly. Not yet. Neck palpation. Okay. Really didn't do much. Okay. Do the chest. Have you done the chest? You've done the chest, haven't you? Okay. Um, do a CRP. And then you know what? Send him for a blood test. CBC sampling? He's got weakness and ble breathing, ble ble breathing problems, which could be iron deficiency anemia. Yeah, go do that. Take some blood, send him on his merry way. You can go home. There you go. Marvellous. Excellent, excellent. We're at 21. This is good. This is good. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, physical examination chest. On. That's fine. Breathing problem. Oh, patient is... And he's just in the corridor. You know what? Send him away. Not really that fast. He went to the labs and he collapsed. Someone help him. Oh, good lab staff. Good lab staff. But yeah, we're sending him away. Oh, look at him with his little flick of hair. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> A common cold or that. Okay, so we need antivirals or rest. Um, do a CRP. There we go. Maybe that might help. Don't think it will. CRP is basically for inflammation, so it's not going to... Yeah, I didn't think it was going to tell us anything. Um, let's go for... Oh, can we do a... Where is it? Nasal cavity inspection? Yeah, go for that. Maybe that will help? Is that going to help? Is it helping? Has it helped? Hey, there we go. Nasal viral infection. Perfect. Done. Okay, have them and we'll send you home. We're not really that busy overnight, are we? Really not. 58,000. Oh, man. Yeah, those wages. Holy mode. Uh, rest. Yeah, go. Go home. Go and rest. It's like 11 o'clock at night and you've come in with a common cold. Really? Really? BBC sampling. That not told us much, has it? Oh, okay. So what have you got? Chills, fever, breathing problems, fatigue, chest pain, and headache. Are these all internal medicine? Internal medicine, emergency, internal medicine, internal medicine. Infectious. You know what? Go to internal medicine, please. They'll be able to help you more than me. That is for sure. But yeah, I don't know what they're going to do. Um, are you going to do any more testing? What are you going to do? Microbial sampling. Well, that would make sense. That would make a lot of sense. Sorry, the little mittens. The little mittens do make me laugh. Right, head off to the labs. We really don't have much 
Okay, we need some more... We need some more vending machines, don't we? That could be helpful. Um, yeah, some more vending machines. That would be helpful. We'll, we'll get some in a bit. Right, sweating. So what have you had? You've had physical examination. What is wrong with you? Tenderness, sweating. You've had... What have you had? You've had x-ray. Chest. You don't know whether it's ankle, 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 broken ribs, foot contusion, or... Oh, good God! It could be anything! Jesus Christ! Okay, swelling and tenderness. But where? Where? Um... Okay, so maybe we send you for a... Hmm... X-ray lower limb and x-ray upper limb maybe things as we don't know whether it's broken ribs arm contusion we don't know where the pain is surely the physical examination would have told us that you would think right you would think uh, serological sampling done you've got influenza b <coughs> okay right send you home well don't send you nearly home with all that we haven't got anyone in pharmacy yet so that's fine you're an office clerk. Mm, eh. Germaphobe. But like I said, I can't. Oops. No. There we go. Good. Perfect. Oh, are you waiting for something? Have we got someone waiting for something? You know, oh, she's got lupus. Okay. So get her with all of them. Good. And do you need to... Internal medicine thing, but... No, if we send her home with corticosteroids, she'll be fine. Lupus findings. Hmm. Oh, she does need IV corticosteroids. Okay. Okay, my bad. Go there. Go somewhere else. Go to someone else. <laughs> this one. What did we do? CBC thing. CBC testing. Really? Right, that's cardiology, neurology, emergency, infectious diseases, or traumatology. I'm thinking it's iron deficiency anemia. So to, to get iron deficiency anemia diagnosed, we need to do. We need to do. It's, it's not CBC, clearly. Okay. I can't remember what it was. Well, in reality, it would be CBC, but we'll do a blood draw. Go have a blood draw. Yeah. It's, ugh, yeah, it is what it is. It is what it is. I just sent them for a full blood count, but hey ho, who am I to who am I to know how the game goes about it? What does this yellow mean? What that meant? It's fine, it's fine. Right, we're at twenty three out of thirty. We might get there. We might get there. Fifty eight thousand. Right, let's just speed time along nice and fast. There we go great, good, good. Come on, bring us the money. In the morning, we need to get a load of money. Right, that's the that's the kind of plan. Cleaners are keeping it nice and clean. This is good. This is good. Right, interview. Laryngitis or the mumps? Right, let's have a look at your neck palpation. There we go. Get that done. Boop, boop. Right, laryngitis. There we go. Swallow pain and dysphagia, which is, yeah, difficulty and pain swallowing. Cool. Give them all of them. And then once that comes up, we shall send you home. Oh, oh, yeah. Ankle contusion or ankle fracture. Right, let's do a bit of physical joint immobility. Let's do a physical examination. If not, we'll send you for an x-ray. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, we'll send you for an x-ray. It's fine. Uh, yeah, you walk off to that x-ray. <laughs> you can't move your leg, but send you for an x-ray, right? Uh, we'll, yeah, we'll make you walk. Yeah, you go home. 80. Pharyngitis, okay. 25, good, have all of the above. Look at that, so happy, go home. Joseph Smith, where are you, Joseph Smith? Uh, ooh, essential thromocythemia. Ooh, um, yeah, basically they've got too many platelets in their blood, which is actually a real, quite a big problem because it's um let out a load of potassium so it can really cause well high potassium is never a good thing because that can um cause all sorts of um bad um uh cardiac problems which obviously we can't deal with at this point in time uh oh christ okay uh yeah we don't want that to be that migraine okay fair or stroke cardiology 
We'll just do a physical examination, see what happens. Not good. He's got assembled essential thrombocythemia. Oh, hydroxyuric. Uh, we can't do anything. Right. Do that. And then we'll send you somewhere else. We'll give you these things. Okay. Uh, and then you know what? Send away. There we go. We can't do anything with you. Can't do anything with you. Right. Foot contusion. There you go. Ice wrap, analgesics, ointment. 27 out of 30. Come on, come on, come on. Go home. There we go. This is what we should have been doing all along. Did see? Look. Fraser Hill, I knew you had iron deficiency. Low hematocrit. What was that? That was that was blood draw, wasn't it? Okay, blood draw and blood test. Right, cool. Good to know. Good to know. That's what we need to do in future. Right, bronchodilators, analgesics, and iron supplementation. Have some iron, man. Yeah, as an acrobat, that's really not good, is it? You really don't want them having no low iron as an acrobat. Jeez, no. He won't be able to do a thing. He'll barely be able to hold himself up. Right, you go home. Good. Um, yeah, we we did you. Cool, 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 cool. Um, do we? Yeah. Uh, you there? Ankle contusion. Yep. Have all of them, and then go home. Yeah. Do we need? I'm thinking. Yeah, we need a pharmacist overnight, don't we? Because they're basically not coming. They're not giving us any money. Although it's six o'clock in the morning. Do we bother hiring anyone? You there, what what do you have? Germaphobe hedonist. Oh, let's let's do it. Oh you, Thomas Gonzalez, there we go. Yeah, because we're not getting the money for the pharmacy, are we? Because yeah, they're just going somewhere else. Ah uh, fool. Oh, whereas she should now go to pharmacy, go into pharmacy. Ah, uh, I was missing a trick there. Missing a trick. Right, let's have a quick look at your nasal cavity. There we go. <laughs> let me let me see your nasal cavity. That's an interview, right? Vomiting, excessive flatulence, diarrhea. So yeah, I'm thinking Crohn's disease or lactose intolerance. It'd probably be lactose intolerance. Do a bit of physical examination. Nasal nasal cavity. Ooh, did not show us anything. Okay. Physical examination. And how's about a blood draw? There we go. I'm learning. I'm learning. Oh, okay. Physical examination did get it down. Okay. Yes, yeah, so you're going for blood draw now. So that's fine. 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 We're getting there. We're getting there. What are you saying? You us. Oh, yeah, lactose intolerance. See? Way 20 grand. Why, thank you. Why, thank you. There we go. And then you can go home soon. There we go. Well, go home. Go to pharmacy. You going to pharmacy? Yes. Oh, what an idiot I was, not having a pharmacist overnight. Ah, oh, so much money wasted. Right, let's see if we can get away with it with just a physical examination. No, we can't, right? Lower, lower, lower limb x-ray. Go. Hobble off. Hobble your way away. Right, now, okay, 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 okay. Uh, David, uh, we'll keep him pinned. Right, we've got Frank. Don't look. Look at Frank. Where's Frank? Uh, no, okay. Yeah, uh, it's fine. It's fine. Right. Night shift has been paid. Yeah, night shift has been paid. Let's have a look at um money quickly. Oh. Oh, we lost some money yesterday. Now that's today. Yesterday minus eleven thousand. Uh, no, not minus eleven thousand. Eleven thousand. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Right, what have we got? Treat patients in controlled resident mode. Okay, what is that going to give us? Increase the number of patients. Oh, great. Just what we need. Oh, just what we need. Uleremia, viral tonsillitis. Right, physical examination and neck palpation. There we go. Let's, let's poke and prod you a little bit. Okay, we've got a headache. Okay, so you know what? Do a CRP, then we can rule out bacterial possibly. I want to say. No, we can't. Mm. Mm. That's how my logic would work it, but hey ho, we'll send you for a blood draw. That seems to cover a whole manner of things. How are they doing over here? Are they not overrun, but this is night time. We'll keep an eye. We'll keep an eye. Pharmacy should be zooming through people. Good. Oh, 
Christ alive. Okay, physical examination. <coughs> I mean, seriously, let's do a bit of chest as well. There we go. Chills, headache. Okay, the chest didn't do anything. Um, thorax percussion? No, nothing. Okay, let's send you for a blood draw. There we go, done. Oh, actually, microbial sampling as well. Mm hmm. There you go. Have both. Yeah, yeah. Go have both whilst you're at it. Okay, it's looking busy in here. Okay, internal medicine. Uh, ulcerative colitis. General surgery, and that's internal medicine. Oh, man. Okay, you're going to have to go somewhere else. We haven't got an ITU. Just go home. Get away. This this financial crisis really is messing us up. All right, physical examination. We should be able to tell exactly what it is. We'll get rid of this dude. Um, nothing to see here, people. Nothing to see here. Golfer's elbow. Have all of them. Okay. Here we go. We've got one person treated. Well, hopefully this will be number two, I want to say. Maybe. Uh, oh, what have we got? Robert Davis. Oh, thoracic aortic aneurysm. No, don't want one of them. Um, just try, doctor. Just try. Yeah, yeah. You can. I trust my doctors. I trust my doctors to do what they should do. You there? Pause for the briefest of seconds. Yeah, go home. Here we go. Did that count? Yes, that counted. Number two. Right. Okay. So let's let's grab ourselves another couple of doctors in here, right? In emergency. Here we go. So shall we go, Karen Allen? Yeah. Let's get Karen Allen and William Walker. There we go. Good. Well, you know what? Let's go for them all. Um, and then Karen Brown. There we go. Good. Right. Marvelous. Now we'll probably not whiz through them, but you know what? It's fine. We'll whiz through this. We will whiz through this. Cough suppressants, go home. Okay. Yeah, number three. <laughs> excellent. We just jumped on their thing. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Uh, physical examination, please. Okay, right. Ankle fracture or contusion? You know what? I just don't know. So you're going to go for a lower limb. X-ray. There you go. Head off. God, go to. Right. That didn't tell us anything. CBC testing. Can't we do a bit of the old... Where is it? Microbial testing. They have that? They already had that. They already had that. Wow, they have had a lot of stuff. You know what? All of this cardiology, cardiology, internal medicine, internal medicine, internal medicine. You know what? Go to internal medicine. There you go. Pause for the briefest of seconds. X-ray is looking good. This is not looking too bad. How many do we have in a queue? Six here. Oh. Oh. Well, that's that's painful, isn't it? Okay, okay, okay. Can we do can we do a bit of a a cheat here? How about a square a table right there? There we go. And on here we'll place a PC. Uh, you there aha there we go <laughs> had it the wrong way around pc with a what kind of sword have we got black yeah okay oh no not that here we go we can get someone else in here okay biochemistry usg advanced biochemistry you're gonna be late but you're not on your own so yeah brooke Hernandez, come on in there we go that should get through him a bit quicker. All right, physical examination. Common cold laryngitis. Let's have a look up your nose. Where are you? Oral nasal cavity. There you go. Oh, Christ, this is coming through. Right, um, nasal cavity again. There we go. Have a look up the nose. <coughs> right, how is that looking? Yeah, look, they're both busy. That's good. That'll make stuff go a lot quicker. We might need another um analyzer. Yeah, we might need another analyzer. Leg contusion. You know what? Physical examination. There you go. Pause for the briefest second. I want to see how Angles is doing. 41 and 9 percent. Bad. Nasal cavity. Yep, yeah, you have the common cold. I have all them. Oh, Christ. Nasal cavity. Yeah, you've got the common cold as well. It's clearly the season of it. It, it is cold. 
It is cold. Um, complicated diagnosis. Don't know, do you? You don't know. Do a differential. There you go. Yeah, try that. Go on, do a differential. Oh, and you're doing temperature measurement. I wanted you to do differential. Fine, it's fine. Um, physical examination, please. Have we done that? We've done the physical examination. Oh, okay. Okay. Send them for a lower limb. Wow, so many patients, so many patients. We've got this, we've got this. We have got this. Interview. Oh, let's try a physical examination. It's always worth just looking. It's always worth just having a look. You never know, you might be able to say, oh, it's a it's a contusion. No. Okay. X-ray and OM. I'm trying to save you guys some X-rays here, okay? I'm trying to save you the X-rays, because how is X-ray looking? For God's sake, so many patients. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Sputum cough. Oh good God. Don't don't catch anything, Angles. Yeah, don't catch COVID-19. Whatever you do, do not catch it. Um, okay, so they're all okay, back to so let's do a quick nasal cavity. No, not well, do both. There you go. It's fine. Um, yeah, go home. Four. Yeah, you can go home as well. Number five. Excellent. Oh, look at... Oh, wow. Okay. This this here is busy. Okay, okay, okay. Internal medicine. We'll do a bit of the old... Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. That. Copy. That. Throat. Round. And plonk you there. Yes. Then we shall hire an internal medicine person. You're not bad. What have you got? Hard worker, rest assistant. Ooh, although you're quite good, but you're late. So yeah, let's get Kate Lee in. There we go. Right, we're up to 80,000. Right, interview. Uh, hay fever, oxoplasmosis, sarcoidosis, hay fever. Okay, let's do a bit of the old um nasal cavity. And you know what? Have a physical examination as well whilst you're at it. There you go. Um, interview. Brooke Adams. Weight loss fatigue. Okay, physical examination to start with. There. Bruise and swelling. Physical examination, please. They're coming in thick and fast here. Thick and fast. Whereabouts are you? Oh, there. Okay, go somewhere else. Send away. How do we, do we see what his health is? I don't see what his health is. You know what? You, you, you're you just going away. Okay, that's fine. Physical examination. Oh, there's nothing. All right, go for microbial sampling. Uh, oh, upper arm. Thing me. At least all we had was swelling and tenderness when she came in. But at least now we know it's limited arm motion and redness. So that's, that's good. We know it's arm at least. So let's go for an x-ray upper limb. Wow. Wow, so much diagnosing going on here. But yeah, we're, we're not doing bad. We're not doing bad. We're, we're managing it. Right, you've got hay fever. Of course you've got hay fever. Just get out of here. Get, get on your bike. You, you got bacterial tonsillitis. Yep, out of my sight. Done. Send these out in a second. Yeah, you're just laying there. That's fine. You've got athlete's foot. Have some of that. Yes, perfect. Yeah, my doctors are pretty good. Crumbly nail, nail discoloration, yeah, 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 all good. Hey, look, the microbial sampling worked. Bronchitis. Have all of the above. And be on your merry way. You there. Can you go home yet? No, antihistamines. You can go home. Treated. Number six. Eye drops. Treated. Go home. Number seven. Analgesics. Treated. Okay, go home. And number eight. Or go to pharmacy at the very least. Oh, Christ. Pharmacy is busy. Uh, where are we? Pause. Oh. Yeah, pharmacy is very, very busy. Okay, okay, okay. Do we... Oh, okay, we'll just sort this out first. Fularemia, tonsillitis. Let's do a... Microbial sampling? Microbial sampling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go try that. X-ray lower limb. 
contusion. Have some of that. Done. Oh yes, I'm all over this. All over this. But I do think... I do think we need to expand pharmacy. We really need to expand pharmacy, don't we? It just is. It pains me to do this. But it is what it is. Right, move room or selected area. Can we... Can't move you. Of course we can't. Can we... Can we... Where is it? Where is it? There. Can we put you there? And then a bucket cart there? We already had one in there, didn't we? Hmm. That's not what I... What? What? What, the, what am I doing? What am I doing? That is not what I wanted to do in the slightest. Get rid of both of them. Sigh. <laughs> Big old sigh. Right, let's... Uh, what, what, what was wrong with me there? Right, let's get these walls there. We'll do a wall like this. How's about, how's about we do you down here? Oh, we need foundations, don't we? That would be helpful. Right. How about... Yeah, that's a four by something or other, isn't it? Yeah. Right. So drop of those walls there. There we go. Build that. There we go. Put a door on here. In the main hospital, these are toilets. So yeah, what we'll do... That, actually, the cleaning is here. Ah, that's... Yeah, this is the whole cleaning office area, isn't it? Well, we could put some toilets here. Yeah, we could put some toilets here and then we can do a cleaning thing here or whatever. Well, well, well whatever. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. No, we want a restricted access, don't we? Yep, there we go. Then we're going to call it a cleaning closet. There we go. In here, we're then going to do yoink, yoink. Shelf, shelf. Yes, Bucket cart and bucket cart. Then you can even have a lab sink there. It's the most ugliest of rooms ever, but it's fine. Oh, we never did the floor. We never did the floor. Let's get some floor like that. There we go. Right, and then whoever's in here, whoever we've got in here. So, Fraser, I want to have a look at you. So, no. Oh, oh man. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, we do it like this, don't we? So we remove you from there. Yes. Yes. There we go. And then in here, yoink. In here we no, that's not what I wanted to do. In here we put Fraser. In here we put Mary. Yes. Yeah, that's perfect, perfect, perfect. Then we can pharmacy. Hand you out like that. Excellent. We need some stations. Whoop. Excellent. Then we can wall, dripper dropper, you. Bring you out like that. Take you around, down like that. Perfect. We shall remove some walls. Eep. Eep. And remove the door would be helpful. That door. Yoink. Then flooring. Now we bring, get you, yoink. So there, perfect. And then if we go in here, we can in there. We then sell you. Yes, we can. Okay, now I did that wrong, didn't I? Okay, pharmacy. Like that. There we go. That's better. That's better. Good. This is good. And we go in here. Yes, there we go. Right, drug shelf, which, yeah, drug shelf with drawers. So if we do that, then we can do a counter advice like that. The PC like that. A bit of the old office chair. Hey, presto. And you know what? What we're going to do, we're actually going to give them a couple of... Yeah, we're going to give them a couple of benches because they're just messy standing in the middle of the way. About there and... And we can't quite do that. We can't quite do that. You know what? And do that though. Yeah, yeah. That's absolutely fine. That's good. That's good. And then in here, yoink. Pharmacy. 
A fresh parent, scholar, night owl. Well, that's typical, isn't it? What are you? You have no hidden things. Okay. So, what we'll do, we'll actually shift you. Can we shift you? We unassign you. Ah. Oh, figure out how to unassign you from a thing because you're really good. Hmm. Okay, so here, we'll hire you, then you, and not... Aha, okay, 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 what was her name? Oh, ah, get, it, get, get, get out, where are we, who are you? You're Carol Martinez, so here, no, here, we'll put Carol Martinez, he's got no workspace, perfect, because we want to put Thomas Gonzalez... Right there. There we go. <laughs> there we go. We've got three pharmacists now. Right, good. Athletes first. Let's do a physical examination. Oof. Oof. Yeah, look at this. This is much better. We've got people sitting down. That's much better. Where did, what's his name, Gonzalez go? I don't know. He probably hasn't come in yet, has he? Fine. There we go. Yeah, look at this. Okay, 81. Look at the money rolled in. This is good. Treat you. Yes. Ah, I do apologise, guys. This is clearly a whole day of just treating patients. But you know what? We need the money. And we're doing good little expansions here. We're, we're expanding. This is the size pharmacy is going to be. We'll probably take it a bit further back. We could probably, yeah, we could probably have the counter along here and then the waiting area there. We could probably do that somehow. But yeah, everywhere else is looking good. Oh, this. Okay, okay. Labs. Labs. What have we got? We've got seven people waiting in here. Holy moly. Hematology is a busy. So, hang you on, hang you on. Are we just... Yep, yep. Contusion. Yep, 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 yep. We just... Every time. It takes me back here. Right. Hmm. Two people... It depends what test they're having. What are they having? They're having blood test. Microbial. Serological testing. Stool testing microbiology. Blood test. Blood test. Serological testing. Um, I don't know what you had. Microbial. Okay. So, if we look in labs, then hematology. So, what does what do? Uh... Where are the things that do the things? Where are the things? Ah, here we go. Blood sample? Okay, that doesn't tell me anything. RIA. Again, it doesn't tell me which one. Luma rays. Hmm. Blood sample analysis. Do I get a third person in here? Where are they going to test? Where are they doing the tests? Okay, you're in the bin. X-ray, arm contusion. Yeah, have all of the above. Okay, pause. Get back to the lab. Where are they doing the testing? Computer, right. The bin. Think. Think. Uh-huh. Huh? Tell me where you're doing the testing. You're not. You're just... What are you stood there for? Ah! Yeah. <laughs> uh. Right, pause, get back here. Let's quickly watch. I want to see where they're testing stuff. Okay, glassware. Mm. Nice wrap. Okay, go home, pause. Okay, so do we need more glassware? Maybe need more glassware, because look, they just keep going back to the glassware, don't they? What does the glassware do? Here we go, here we go. Glassware. Air different air. You know what? Let's get another lab desk. Right about there. Let's get let's get the different glassware like that. Yeah. There we go. That might help him out. Maybe. Patient is collapsing. You know what? It's fine. Just go somewhere else. Not first. Okay, so you're testing on there. Microbial sampling. Okay. 
Salmonomenosis. Salmonomenosis. Um, what do you need for that? You need antibiotics. So that's fine. Just have some antibiotics. There we go. Okay. Good. Uh, okay. Last thing we... Ah, lactose intolerance. Excellent. 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 We're getting there. We're getting there, people. Okay. Yes, the two glasswares are helping. Testing on there and testing on there. I think we're going to need duplicates of everything. Oh, patient's collapsing there. Okay, great. Great. We're, we're ignoring that. That's fine. Go home. Here we go. Antibiotics. You can go. I hit go to, didn't I? Didn't mean to hit go to. Actually, how is everything looking down here? We're pretty clear. We are pretty clear. Oh, that is good. That is good. Okay, I'm just clearing all these notifications. Oh, well, there's a, there's a few of them. There's just a few of them. Oh, good God. How many are there? Oh, it's because I'm controlling so many doctors, isn't it? Right, okay. So this is all clear. The lab is not clear. Actually, can we... In here, in here... Can we, if I go, what is it, shift? No, control. You, you can go there. Oh, yes. And then we can get some different analyzers in there. Yes, I like that. So, yeah, you know what? Printer can come here. Can't move the computer. Move the computer overnight. Yeah, yeah, that'd be perfect. She's going to go home, isn't she? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is how we get this to work. Oh, this is good. This is good. But, yeah, hematology is definitely overrun. Definitely overrun. Right, bronchiostasis, what do you need for that? Antibiotics. So yeah, that's fine. You can just... Some of them. Yeah, the lab is definitely moving quicker. Now I've got two lots of um, glassware. That's much better. Interview. Viral tonsillitis? Have some of that. There we go. Perfect. Hey, we're up to 15 already. Just as we're watching the labs to try and make them the labs move faster. This is good. This is good. Doing bad. These guys are. How are we looking? How are we looking patient wise? Three and two. Okay. Oh, don't hit that. Here we go. Rest. Go home. Perfect. Oh, this is good. This is good. Microbial sampling. What's that told us? Bacterial tonsillitis. Some of them have some of them. Excellent. Oh, this is awesome. I'm so happy with this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get to the end of the day. Um, yeah. Wait until we get to the end of the day, and then I'll call it a day for today. But yeah, we are we are whizzing through stuff now. Oh, this is awesome. This is absolutely fantastic. Good. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Uh, do a physical examination. You never know. You might be able to figure it out just by looking. Maybe we might have to send you for a lower... Lower... Yeah. Lower. Dim x-ray. It's fine. Thought I'd try it. You never know. I never know. Might have got lucky. But yeah, two sets of glassware is definitely extremely helpful. Um, it would be extremely helpful if we had a tea room out the back here. Or a break room. Because those two have both gone for... Oh, they've both gone to toilet or to break. I'm not sure. One of the two. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, Christ. Okay, you've got a lot. Right. Physical examination. Let's see what, what what's up with you. You're a teacher. Oh, oh so many... So, I was just going to say, there's 23 pages of possible diagnosis. But yeah, rash on arm, rash on torso, widespread... Yeah, you've got shingles. Shingles, oh, shingles, not good. I haven't had shingles, but yes, I have known people who have had them. They have not been well. They have not been happy. Nail fungus, foot cream, or antifungal. There we go. Oh, we're whizzing through now. Right, so what it, who is this? That is you, isn't it? So that's serological testing. Right, so that little thing is serological testing. No, maybe not. What was that? That was PCR testing. Never going to get this right, am I? Never going to get it right, but it's all good. It's all good. Right, that's fine. No, so you were just... Who you were... Oh, I don't know who you were testing where... Because again, she's got some cooking, she's got some others cooking. It just is what it is. Right, foot cream, antifungal, bit of the same, bit of the same. X-ray, contusion, yeah, bandage, all of that stuff. All of that good stuff. Excellent. How is the ward looking, actually? Ward one, two, 
Patience. Free patience. Wow. Really not that oversubscribed, is it, Award? That's fine. We've got halfway through to getting to our next load of patients. Right, okay, you're on there. So what are you having? You are having serological testing. So yeah, what I thought, this is serological, this is PCR, and this will be blood draw, won't it? I think. Yeah, look, he's the he's the DNA, PCR testing, yeah. Yeah, and she's then jumped on the other dude's job. Yeah, this is good, this is good. It, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Hey, this all makes sense. We are becoming efficient. Hopefully she'll go home and we can, um, yeah, critical workload. We've literally got one, which is the lab, which is what I was expecting. If we go here, critical. Yeah, that's exactly what we thought was going to happen. And it's fine. We're working on it. Right. Whilst we're here, can we in here? Yes, we can. Right. So grab you, plonk you there, grab you, plonk you there. Uh, we can sell you, sell you. There we go. That's good. That's good. We'll put in a lab desk. Uh, so there we go. Grab you, plonk you there. <laughs> Here is my plan. There we go. And then we've got another room for a computer there. And we could put some more testing stuff here if we want. We are using a fair bit of money. But yeah, you know what? We have not done bad at all. We have expanded the labs, or hematology lab at the very least. We've got through a heck of a load of patients. We haven't gained much money. How was our money today? Profit, 12,000. Yeah, we're not hugely profitable, are we? Not hugely. We have just paid all the wages, so that's good. 14. So. Oof, that is painful. That is painful. We've even spent eight grand building, which I wasn't I wasn't going to do any building, but we've had to. We literally have had to. Um, pharmacy, making making as much profit as I would like. Um, but yeah, we're not doing too bad. We're not doing too bad. We haven't taken a loan yet. I think maybe another couple of days of just working through like this, and we've got we've got something pretty efficient now. We have got a pretty efficient little um setup. The labs will be efficient. These guys will be efficient, hopefully, once we get through these guys. So they're going to send us 25 more patients a day. And again, oh, again, we're financial crisis, aren't we? But yeah, that's not helping either. Um, but yeah, we will, we will get there. We will get there. I'll probably try and skip through a load of these diagnoses. Again, I'll, um, it's much of the same, much of the same. It's just, just me babbling and yeah whichever wherever but um yeah i'll work through that uh i will come back i'll i'll start it off and um we'll see um how far we get on the next episode but yeah hope you've enjoyed uh i apologize that it has been very much just doctor control doctor heavy today it really has been i really want to get through these we're at six out of eleven yeah nine out of fourteen we really will need to get hospital emergency but we're not ready for it we are not ready for it at all we can't yeah, we can't do collapsed patients. We we are nowhere near ready for that. Not how we're set up at the moment. These labs need to be expanded so much. So, so much. We need some toilets. We need a tea room, break room. We need so much stuff everywhere. So, yeah, we're just going to carry on working on um, what we have at the moment and making it really functional. And then we'll come back and we will um, we will make it, um, we will make, we will make expand. But yeah, I will hold it here and I will catch you on the next one. Doodles, folks.